we haven't had to replace them yet, you know, over the four or five years that we've been using them. The cost savings went to a full, about an $18,000 a year cost savings. Uh, we're running at a full 100%. Parts coming loose, uh, tool, tool breakage, the cost of delays are virtually a thing of the past. What are these guys talking about? Well, they're talking about the new patented Tiny Vice edge clamps. So the Mighty Bites last about a month before we have to replace them versus the Tiny Vice, which we haven't had to replace them yet. Uh, they have many, many uses. You don't want to limit, it, limit this particular clamping system just to uh, milling centers because it's you can almost use it for anything. I can't believe how easy it was. We simply switched to the Tiny Vice edge clamp it, uh, it increased our production over 30%. Only tiny vice clamps exert down thrust force on the workpiece to prevent it from lifting. The thrust washer under the clamp engages a second mating countersink to provide downward action. There's also a double edge tiny vice clamp which allows clamping two workpieces at the same time. Unlike other clamps, they have floating thrust washers which compensate for size variation in workpieces and securely clamp multiple parts with equal force. Here at Quickie, we make uh, custom lightweight wheelchairs and uh, we use a lot of fixtures, a lot of clamping devices. Uh, before then, we were using the Mighty Bites. Thought that was the best thing on the market until we started running into problems of it wearing out uh, frequently because of the material it's being made out of. On the Mighty Bite, it, first it takes, as you can see, a lot more to hold down than a Tiny Vice. Also, getting them in, you have to use the T-wrench to re release them because it's on a cam, only a quarter turn. Versus the Tiny Vice, one tool to lock it down, it's on and off. Why switch to Tiny Vice? Production capacity is greatly increased, while tool and part breakage will be significantly reduced. Tiny Vices are quick and easy to switch over to. Competitors' clamps are awkward to line up and require manual force to tighten and release. But with Tiny Vice, you can use ergonomically friendly air tools. And the patented unique horizontal and vertical holding power sets this tough clamp apart. This is designed that where you can put the clamp, uh, if you are doing uh, machining aluminum parts, aluminum parts, it has a smooth side on it, and uh, the other side of the clamp has a ser uh, serration uh, a jaw, so it'll actually bite the part. Say you're doing steel and you want to really grip it, or if you want to grip aluminum um, where you don't care about the finish, um, it has an either or depending on what you're machining. This is the new uh, Carlane uh, opposed uh, tiny vise. It's designed to hold a part on the, both sides of the clamp. The idea behind that is when you're clamping parts on, uh, on each side, they don't have to be exactly the same size. One could be 20, 30 thousandths larger than the other. It'll still clamp. It'll still zero in and clamp the part um, with tremendous holding power. A wide range of sizes is available, from a miniature number 8 32 thread size up to a powerful 1 inch 8 thread with 2,500 pounds clamping force. But you know the benefit that I'm most pleased with? The, uh, because of the savings and the increased production within our budget. Uh, we're able to buy the additional equipment we've been wanting for expansion. So it's incredible how one simple little device can so dramatically affect our entire operation. It's, it's, it's truly amazing. Tiny Vice Clamp is the featured product in the new Car Lane catalog, offering a selection of thousands of quality tools for the manufacturing industry. Order your catalog by logging on to www.carlane.com or see your local Car Lane distributor. We've got quality and selection and great prices and service too. In fact, 90% of all orders have been going out within 24 hours. So for the best in clamps, turn on to Tiny Vice from Carlane Manufacturing.